Good evening, everybody. Thanks for joining us on Fox 31 News. I'm Stephanie Martinez. New tonight, an Albany store owner speaks out about being held at gunpoint yesterday afternoon. Now, it's something his business has never experienced in its 60 years there. Now, Fox 31's Cody Long connects you to what the owner says may have saved him from being in danger and what the next step is. Jerry Doyle owns this party supply store that's been in Albany for 60 years. And now, after he was robbed at gunpoint, he plans to close it later this year. I'm scared. I feel violated. We've been in 63 years, served, served the south side of Albany. We've always been nice to everybody, try to be good. Doyle says he was helping a customer when a man approached him and had his back turned towards him. He asked for change for a dollar. Doyle reached to give him the quarters. Uh, he said, I got something else for you. And he turned around and he had a, a rifle, which I don't know what kind of gun it was, but it looked like sort of like an assault rifle, but I don't know. Doyle says he knew just what to do after watching a training video about how to react to armed robbers. Do not confront. Do not make direct eye contact. And I did not. I did what he told me to do. This was just one of two businesses robbed within the same hour. Police want store owners and employees to know ways to stay safe. If someone coming in out your business and they're not about purchasing anything, more likely they are canvassing what they can and cannot do. So make sure you like look, look around your surroundings. Uh, make sure that your video surveillance is up to date. And just like Neighborhood Watch, APD has a business watch program they want business owners to know about. So, uh, we make contact with the businesses and let them know when and where they can come at. Cody Long, Fox 31 News.